after a few weeks of sitting on the shelf, our Stampede 4x4 is going to be running again. How's it going guys? Josh here with Trax RC and today we will be installing the upgraded ring and pinion gear for the front in our Stampede 4x4. This is kind of like part three in a miniature series that we're doing where we're upgrading the differentials in our Stampede 4x4 and we'll put a link to the playlist right up here and also in the description box down below. So if you haven't seen the other two videos in this playlist, then you can go ahead and watch those. And I would recommend that you watch those videos before you watch this one, just because they all kind of tie into each other and it showed our struggles along the way. So along with the new ring and pinion for the front, we're going to install this Robinson Racing 11 tooth pinion gear that we have sitting around. Right now we're running an 11 tooth pinion gear and because these new ring and pinion gears have a higher gear ratio than the stock ones, that's way over geared so we're just going to drop that pinion gear down a couple of teeth so we're not going to film what we're doing during this install because we already did that in the last two videos so we're just going to cut the camera right now and put you guys back on when these parts are installed all right guys so now we're done installing the new ring and pinion in the front diff and then we're also done installing the new robinson racing 11 tooth pinion gear as for the install it was pretty simple we did have a few hiccups like the front ring gear um, it was a kind of a tight fit onto the diff cup, but we did sort it out and then the pinion gear actually took us the most time And that's just because the 13 tooth pinion gear that we had on it the grub screw was stripped And so we kind of had to file it down a lot to kind of make that grub screw a flathead So then we could get a flathead screwdriver and rotate the grub screw to get it off the motor shaft. And then we just installed the Robinson Racing Pinion Gear. And I guess that it was a good thing that we changed out the ring and pinion in the front diff because the old one, they did have a little bit um, of wear. The ring gear was the worst. The pinion gear just has a little bit of uh, a crack in one of the teeth. And then the ring gear shows a little bit of wear. But what amazes me is that it didn't even sound like it was clicking. But hey, it's all done and hopefully our stampede worked. So let's go ahead and take this thing for a rip outside. All right guys, so we hope that you enjoyed that little bit of bash footage that we got with our Stampede 4x4. We did have to end it a little bit short because I think the pinion gear is coming loose and I don't have any tools with me right now. So that was kind of bad on my part, but we had a great time while we could. And as for the new spiral cut gears, don't really know they didn't break as you guys saw but we'll have to see long term we'll put a link down in the description box below to the spiral cut gears that we installed in this video and we'll also have a link down there to our facebook page and our website so we hope that you guys enjoyed this video if you did like share and don't forget to subscribe see you next time on tracks rc